Wrapping up the month tomorrow, happy Halloween to you. And it looks like it's going to be a cloudy one. And we're also wrapping up uh, what has been a wet month. 4.12 inches of rainfall so far. We'll see how we tack on to that uh, tomorrow night as some showers push on in. Normal precipitation, 2.77. That means we are 1.35 inches above normal in the rainfall department. We didn't crack any top 10 lists this month. And as far as uh, temperatures go, a little above normal. 52.3, our average temperature, the normal 51.1. So a little warm, a little wet uh, for this October. Let's go ahead and take a look at temperatures right now to see where we're falling tonight. And for the most part, temperatures have been uh, dropping slowly. Uh, through the 40s, uh, down to 43 in Austintown. Newton Falls, you're the cold spot at 41, 44 in Columbiana, and 44 in Elwood City in southern uh, Lawrence County. A lot of clouds out there all day long. These clouds would not break up today, and it looks like a big part of this evening and into early tomorrow morning is going to stay the same way. Although, seeing a few little holes in the clouds here around Toledo and northwestern Ohio. The bad news is this hole is going to be short lived because the next storm system out to our west are pushing clouds our way and that'll quickly replace any holes. But if you wake up early tomorrow morning, you probably have your best chance of seeing some sunshine out there uh, before this next storm system that's shoving through the middle part of the country uh, pushes more clouds in our direction. And eventually that's going to bring us some rainfall too, uh, especially Saturday night. Uh, here's future tracker through tomorrow morning temperatures falling into the upper 30s to start your Saturday morning again some filtered sunshine early tomorrow more clouds build in through your Halloween 10 11 o'clock temperatures will get back into the, the mid to upper 40s and uh, heading out to some uh, trick-or-treat times tomorrow afternoon around 1 o'clock temperatures are close to the low 50s here at home and that's where we'll stay most of the afternoon we'll climb into the middle 50s uh, by late afternoon and evening now, I'm keeping a very tiny chance for an isolated shower spring tomorrow evening a much better chance as we go into tomorrow night especially later tomorrow night 12 1 o'clock in the morning uh, that's when the best chance of rain moves through so a little good news for your weekend weather looks like the wettest part will be as you're sleeping Saturday night into Sunday morning and of course you want to turn those clocks back during that time period too, uh, back one hour Sunday morning some showers around clouds around too but as the day goes on the weather will improve uh, by midday highs uh, in the upper 50s uh, at that point eventually heading towards 60 as that sunshine breaks out late Sunday into a Sunday afternoon 36 tonight mainly cloudy tomorrow a lot of clouds for your Halloween highs in the mid 50s and a small risk for that isolated sprinkle tomorrow evening. A much better chance for that rainfall as those clocks go back on your Saturday night into Sunday morning. Also, a quick reminder from the fire departments, don't forget to check the batteries and your smoke alarms there as Saturday night into Sunday morning. Seven-day forecast showing you temperatures of 60 on Sunday. Here comes the mid-60s again Monday. Sunshine, too, in a big way for Election Day. 70s back in the forecast. What a warm-up next week staying in the mid to upper 60s right through next Friday. Good thing this weekend is the rain's coming tomorrow night and early Sunday morning. Right? It's a salvage yeah. Sunday afternoon. That's right. Yeah, Sunday afternoon actually doesn't look too bad. Okay. Around 60 degrees and sunshine returns. So. Sounds good. Thanks, Paul. Thanks, Paul.